Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 34 of Spy Family. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. See, still, no one hears that this is happening. <laughs> mm. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay, Anya. Distraction by fireworks. <laughs> Something tell me she gonna sneak out and then go try to help both of them. <laughs>
<laughs> You're not gonna. <laughs> oh my god! Sneak, sneak, sneak. Lloyd. This dude really does want to let up, damn. Are you gonna throw the weapon to <laughs> A for effort, baby. Damn. <laughs> sure, Anya. <laughs> But she's gonna win though. Oh. 
Told ya. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> A second fucking bomb. Oh my god! There's no time! <laughs> There's a bomb in the clock. Oh, of course, because he's the only one who wanted the money the most.
Because <laughs> oh. the clock. What if he throws it right where those two are? That would be hilarious. Not anymore! A lot of people could have died, but yeah, just those two. Aww. 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 Yeah, go hang out with them. You did the good. <laughs> but they're really your family in a way. No. <laughs>
So, yes, in the end, the mission was six success! Yes. Oh my god. But the fact is, like, Anya, in the end, she was helping both her mom and dad. It was so freaking cute. Oh my god. Baby did such a damn good job. Yes, with the throw, with the, oh hey, there's something suspicious about the Oh my god, you should definitely check it out. <laughs> and trying to still help, but no, of course, the daycare attendant was like, hey, yo, like, what you doing? Finally found your little behind. Come on, let's go. <laughs> but, oh, I honestly wish we got to see them hang out, though, but it's okay. We're going to get that probably next week, even though possibly, I'm guessing we're going to go back home and see how everybody else is doing, so going back to Yuri and stuff. But still, it was a cute little mission. I'm glad it was, like, mainly focused on Best Girl Yor, because, duh, Yor needed that focus, and I'm glad she got it. It was just the best thing I needed for these last couple of weeks, and she did really good. I love the fact that we got to see, you know, still a more, an even more wholesome side with her, especially, you know, taking care of, you know, um... The people who she was watching over for especially you know a mom and a baby and stuff because then you get to learn like yeah you are hanging out with a family and just to see how wholesome it is no oh my god up oh, and there's you <laughs> of course you can't have a returning home episode without eerie <laughs> did you know that boy he, he is wa he waiting for the day you'll come back. We're like, oh my god, yo, it's <laughs> like, oh my god, yes, my sister is back home. I can't go see her whenever I want. <laughs> Boy, shut up. <laughs> oh god, I cannot. <laughs> but honestly, seriously. As someone who is not really into going into crew on cruises because not only Titanic one, um, also all these other big, big, big things that I've seen about which the bad things about cruises, especially the last one that I saw was um this is I think this was pre pandemic. Um there was I think I don't know it was it was one of the cruise lines. Um, they ran out of power. And, or electricity. For like several days. So of course they couldn't use the toilet or anything. Things stocked up and things like that. I could not imagine being stuck on that boat for several days. And not having running water, no electricity, no nothing. You're screwed. You're pretty much screwed. Like, you, pro you probably can still make a phone call and stuff. But this is also why, for me, and how I am, like, when hurricane season, hurricane tornado season comes in the summer. Especially, like, I'm a person who's really ready. I make sure I have everything settled for me. Same thing with my mom. Oh. Oh, shoot. Excuse me. And my dog. Because if the power goes out, you're screwed. And you can't really do anything. And that's why, like, if I needed to really make a phone call or whatever, psh, make that freaking phone call, bitch. But, yeah, I will never go on a cruise. Just as much as I said with laid back camp, even though I was like, oh, my God, this is so cute and wholesome. I would love to go camping. I'm never going camping. I'll go glamping, which is still the same thing. But I'll be mindful. I am not that type of person who is like, we are not going in the woods by ourselves in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of the night. That's the same thing with the cruise. If we are so many, like, levels away from islands or anything of land and something happens, bruh, I'm just gonna be over here like, I fucking told you. I told you we shouldn't have gone on this trip, but you, you insisted you wanted to go. But still, it was really nice to see everything, though. Yeah. And so in my mind, I kind of went, even though I'm sitting here right here, you know.
but no, I will never go. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 34 of Spy Family. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 35. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.